Hello everybody, welcome to the next episode of Random Euro Truck Simulator 2. I've just had a look, there are five companies in this uh, Finnish town where we're currently located. So we between numbers one to five and we're going to be heading to company number four on the list. Let's go and check out what it is. Right, just before we get started, I did do something off camera. I sold that three star truck because it needed uh, maintenance. Now I can't do that because I'm not in London. Um, I probably could have transferred it over to where I am, but it's just messing around. So I, I just sold it and I bought another second hand truck which is available to use. So hopefully that driver I've employed will start driving soon. Um, anyway, let's um, see where we're going. So I think it's that one. Yeah, so we're either going to Polotsk in Belarus or St. Petersburg in Russia. They both go in the same direction, but Polotsk is a lot further. So let's randomly click on... Um, this one to St. Petersburg and go and pick up our load. Okay, here we go. Yeah, so when I look at these buildings, I don't, I've never been to Finland, right, first of all, but I don't see like any kind of Finnish language writing, there's no shops, it's just, it's not like apartments, it just looks very generic. I'd like to see Finland come alive more, have more character to it. We are finished. Let's just double check our destinations. So it's Polotsk uh, or St. Petersburg. Two places that I've been to. Okay, in real life. Okay, so it's between one and two. Let's see where we're going. Two. I think that was St. Petersburg, number two. It's a short one. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so let's pick up. Well, okay, pick up, let's choose. It was number two, so it is St. Petersburg. Nice short journey over into Russia. Let's do this. So, really looking forward to this journey. I love driving in Russia. It's, it's amazing. So good um, driving in Russia. Ready to go. Prastori Rasi. Let's say Pritzeli Aftomnish. Skinny are skins, huh? Dostavka v vse regioni Rasi. So, um, Dostavki. Deliveries to all Russian regions. Right, okay, let's just check the route. It's a short route. Make sure it's how I want it. So it's straight over into Russia, no messing around. 
straight down there. Okay, and it's very easy once we get to St. Petersburg. Okay, nice and easy. Let's do it. After Russia for the first time in this, where am I going? In this series. This is a bit awkward. Let's make sure we get out of here in one piece. I actually want to make sure we get to Russia. Turn right. You know, I actually just uh, paused the game there, just checking on my computer. Uh, it seems to be okay. Just making some funny noises. Jeez, this is a struggle. This must be proper uphill.
border formalities here. This is not a straightforward border. Um, so I've got to make sure I get all this right. Okay, this seems like fairly straightforward. Sometimes you have those weighing machines and stuff. It looks like we're into Russia. So I can talk about my experience then in St. Petersburg. I've only been there once. It was many years ago. And it was thanks to St. Petersburg that I started to study Russian. I just fell in love with the place. I was only there for a couple of days. I love this map, look at it, it's so nice. And yeah, sort of my love for Russia and the former Soviet Union started from there really.
Oh, I love it. She's so oh, flat. Right She's so Russian. <laughs> so good. Is this Rust map? Go straight on. Straight on. I love driving slowly through Russia. It's just so much detail. It's just so. Oh, it's lovely. These cars parked on the side of the road. A larder, another larder. Signposts, buildings, and the sheds. So good. And even the road, it's like okay, it's a good quality road. But I mean it's it's not hasn't got like lines written on it, like I mean through the middle, it's just a just a track. Well it's a road, not a track. Look at this, it's all it's quite a narrow road, isn't it? detail is it's just fantastic you compare this to somewhere like Finland where I've just been this is on another level completely no disrespect to the makers of the whoever made Finland it might have been pro mods but no this is this is great
I know I keep singing its praises, this map is incredible. This must be Rust map, it can't be anyone else, I don't think. Correct me if I'm wrong. The level of detail is astonishing. Absolutely love this. All the villages and towns we're going through. It's so detailed, isn't it? Look at these rest points as well, like just little things like that on the right hand side. Lovely. So far away from those uh, oh, French and Spanish German motorways. We are in another world here. The level of detail is astonishing. I hope we get to stay in this part of the world, you know, Russia or Belarus, Kazakhstan. No, in my luck we won't get sent back.
then exit right. Exit right. So yeah, even though it's a short one, it's not that short in terms of time, like back when you're in Western Europe, a journey of this distance you know, would be very, very short. It's all just motorway traffic. With this, we've been driving through small towns and villages. And a border crossing as well, which took a little bit of time. bus there that we, well, haven't seen anywhere else outside of Russia. I don't know if it's just in St. Petersburg we're going to see that type of bus, whether it's throughout Russia. Turn off then for Narodnaya Ulitsa, the people's street. I've even got Ikea written in Cyrillic. How nice is that? Ikea is shut down in Russia now, I think. Oh, is that where we're going? We're we going to Ikea. It must be. Here we are. It was a nice ride. It's a lovely ride. It really was. Let me just get this right. Right, he wants me to go in there. Um, let me think how to do this best. I think I need to do a U I turn round, do a U turn, and approach it from the side I'm in. Because 
me a lot more leeway. It's quite a tricky one because there's no space ahead of me. It's quite a difficult one, you know. I'll be alright, I'll get it done. Oh shit, just crashed. <laughs> no one noticed though oh it's too much too much too much too much too much no, alright all right, keep going back I'm not going to get in first time but it's not bad again oh it's in there there you go oh move up a little bit stop <laughs> there we go all right no new level So I, I saw there was a parking place very close by in this part of the city. Just here. I think. So yeah, I really enjoyed that short drive. We got out. We got out of Finland very quickly. We had some lovely sort of rural Russian driving. I say like rural. I mean like yeah, going kind of through villages, towns, small towns. I absolutely love that. Yeah, really hoping we stay in Russia. But it's out of my control. Completely out of my control. So if I wasn't doing this randomly, I'd just be driving like, in Russia all the time. You know, in Uzbekistan and Kyrgyzstan and whatnot. Here we are, safe and sound. go okay that's me done thank you for watching guys see you again soon for the next episode